Welcome to the Hack Guy channel today. I'm here to enhance your Discord experience, but I must warn you that I'll be bending a few rules along the way, which might not sit well with Discord. It's a simple process. Really just head over to the website mentioned in the description, download Vanguard, open the installer, click install, and restart Discord. Now, keep in mind that this involves modifying the client, which goes against Discord's rules. However, using it with the official plugins found in the plugins tab won't get you banned. Now, head over to your settings and you'll see Vincor right there. Congratulations, you've successfully installed it. Now, let's dive into how to use it with some popular plugins. There are plenty of official plugins available that won't get you banned. Let's start with the first one, called Fake Nitro. This plugin gives you access to some Nitro features. But let me be clear, it won't give you free Nitro. However, you can still enjoy some Nitro-like perks such as using external emojis, animated emojis, and stickers. The plugin simply sends them as links. Additionally, you can also change your client theme to suit your style. Next up, we have the Member Count plugin. This nifty tool allows you to see the number of online and total members on a server. You'll find this information displayed at the top of the member list. Now, let's talk about folder plugins. There are two options, better folder and plain folder icon. With the first one, your servers will be displayed on the right side instead of popping up below. The second plugin replaces the little server icons inside the folder with a single folder icon. You can even customize the folder color and name to your liking. If you're a fan of animations, you'll love the Always Animate plugin. It automatically animates all images that can be animated, making your Discord client more dynamic. With the Preview Message plugin, you can get a sneak peek of how your message will look in a channel or chat before sending it. Now, let's move on to the Silent Typing plugin. This handy tool allows you to hide the typing alert in friend or server chats. Simply enable these two plugins, and you'll have the option to enable or disable this feature in any chat as needed. No one will be able to see that you're typing a message. One of my personal favorite plugins is PinDM. If you're all about emojis, the Umwaji Cloner plugin is perfect for you. It allows you to quickly copy any Umwaji to your server. Just right-click on the Umwaji you want. Select Clone Umwaji, choose your server, and voila, you can now use it on your server. The Image Zoom plugin is another incredibly useful one. You can customize this plugin to your liking. When you open an image, you'll be able to zoom in right within the Discord client, instead of opening it in a browser. This is especially convenient when someone sends you screenshots with text or code. Last but not least, we have the Usernames plugin. This plugin displays the usernames of all the people in a server. And there you have it. These are just a few of the awesome plugins that Vingord has to offer. So go ahead, give them a try. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content. If you encounter any difficulties, please leave a comment and I will respond as soon as possible. Also, be sure to share this video with your friends or anyone who might find it useful. Thank you for watching. See you guys in the next videos. Bye.